Uh, there's been a little tremor of paranoia running through the audience about going to the first aid tent if you're on a bummer, if things aren't going well for you or whatever. Please be assured, again I repeat, please be assured that there's no bust, there's no hassle, and we'll make every effort to make no unfortunate occurrence for you if you can't handle what's been going down. Please, we'll make every effort to make you as comfortable as possible. Don't throw yourself upon us unless it's absolutely necessary, because at this time we are pretty well swamped. Uh, unfortunately, we're going to call an end to the message center that this stage has been today. All of those who receive messages or want to leave them, they must be left at the information stand. I think it's of necessity that those of you who come with or without medication that uh, you're actually sustaining your life with, or those of you who are keeping your head together by staying with people whom you must be with in order to feel however secure you wish to be, that it's essential that you make provisions for this. In a crowd of this size, we've been blessed with the order that you've given us but we cannot continue to hold your hand as it were. Please, if you will, bear with us. Could we have all ARC operators to their towers now, please? Could we have all ARC operators to their towers, please? Again, to talk briefly about, uh, shall we say, rumors that have been going down. Some people say in the back or wherever you may be that the principles of the fair have copped out. Uh, <laughs> I hardly think this is so. The provisions that have been made for food and water between the army and the volunteers, we're in pretty good shape. Bear with us if you can, please. The only thing that we are dependent upon is your cooperation. I think that's well understood by this time. Those of you sitting directly below the, the crane, which is in front of the stage here, the camera crane, since it'll be in full operation now, could you please squeeze a little to the left and to the right? Those of you sitting directly below the crane, please take care. Ladies and gentlemen, to continue, it's our delight to present Candy. Hey, we're just going to play a little blue.
You know, this is the most outrageous spectacle I've ever witnessed, ever. There's only one thing I wish. I sure got a pee. <laughs> and this ain't nowhere to go. We're gonna get Alan over here on the guitar and do a little going up the country. And I'd also like, I'd like to take this time to introduce you to our newest member. So being now it's official that Henry Vestine has left Canned Heat to form a group called Sun, we now have playing lead guitar Harvey Mandel. So everything's together. I believe we're going to go up the country a little bit right now. Thank you. 
Gotta get going while I can't stay here long now. Cause I'm tired of the way I've been dogged around. Well, I've got to roam, baby, find me a brand new home. guitars tuned back up where they belong before we proceed any further. Thank you, man. We're having a good time. We haven't really had a chance to get together and rehearse yet, because this all kind of came down in the middle of everything. And uh, I got myself an arm. Hold on here a minute. like sucking on an orange, huh? Kind of something neat about it. Reminds me of something. <laughs> All right, you guys.
I guess we weren't quite ready yet. Got to tune them up into a different scene here. I do believe it's a lovely evening for a boogie, you know. <laughs> I would like to boogie on, but we'll just have to give the blind owl a chance, eh? Close enough for jazz, you think, man? Oh, my goodness.
You gotta kind of watch yourself up here. Thank you, man. We're gonna do one with Alan here again. Kind of a change of pace. Let me get this thing together. It's kind of hard running around up here. You keep falling over people. And I got my partner here, man. Give it to him. Are you about ready to get it on, man? All right. Well, I roll and I roll and I roll the whole night long. Well, I roll and I roll, roll the whole night long. I try to find my baby, she's been gone too long. Jump and shout. Well, I know my baby, she's gonna jump and shout. Well, I like the way, baby, you work it on out.
Now, we'd now like to do a little boogie for you right now. So as soon as we get tuned up here, we'll do a little pop festival boogie. Sharon, your father is looking for you backstage. Sharon Wilson. Your papa wants you, baby. Come on back here. continuing in the candy tradition. If you remember our last scene, it was about the same.
ladies and gentlemen, Can P. Ladies and gentlemen, our warm thanks to Ken Pete. Once again, please, can we hear it from Ken Pete? Come on, you can do better than that. Dig. Uh, you don't know how hard these past two weeks have been for this band since Henry left because there was a time when we thought we were going to break up. But we ain't. And I got to say, this is the, I've never had anything like this ever happen to me before. And we'd like to play some more, all right? So we're going to do a little on the road again, I think. <laughs> Can we have a little juice on this other microphone, please? If I can interrupt for just one moment, with my apologies. Sure, man, go right ahead. Those of you that are on the light towers, please, if you will, get the fuck down! Now, please, there are people behind you that can't see. We've been through it all afternoon. You should be somewhat conditioned. There's something about turning back a little bit of responsibility to you as individuals. We would expect that you've got the balls enough to take it. Please do.
treated me and oh, so unkind. Play that thing, man. Thank you.
make some blind man lose his mind. Ladies and gentlemen, can he? Thank you, Mark.